hello friends welcome back to my channel so today we have this easy recipe this is italian sausage smothered in a lots and lots of gravy and if you guys are ready let's get started so to get started with this recipe i have already prepared my seasoning and i'm just showing you guys a plate of seasoning now we are going to move on to making our italian sausage first so in this medium heated pan, I am going to add my four sausages. So this is my hot Italian sausage. So after placing my Italian sausage in the pan, I'm gonna add in some olive oil and I'm adding two tablespoons of olive oil. Next, we are going to add in some water so it can help cook. And this is about a third cup of uh, water. So I'm gonna let it boil by covering it up. So now that it boiled and it also has been frying, we are going to go ahead and flip our sausage. So on this part, you wanna cook for about 10 minutes on medium high. So after flipping my sausage, I cooked it for another five minutes and I went ahead and set it on the side so that way I can start cutting it into small little pieces. So over here, I'm gonna start sauteing my vegetables and I'm gonna start with my onion and garlic as well as ginger. So for every um, ingredient that I have, I'm gonna leave it in the description below. So over here, I am just sauteing my onion, my garlic and ginger for about a minute. So while this is browning, I'm gonna go ahead and start dicing my sausage as you guys can see on the side over here. But make sure you're constantly stirring into your pan while the onions are getting ready. So after cutting the sausage, we are going to go ahead and pour it back into the pan. So after that, you wanna saute them for about another minute. Next, we are going to go ahead and add all the other vegetables in there and then continue stir frying them. So after stir frying for a little bit, I'm gonna add in one teaspoon of tomato paste. So after adding the tomato paste, we are going to go ahead and saute this for about a minute to make sure that the tomato paste is uh, coated into our ingredients so after stir frying for a little bit i'm going to go ahead and add in all my seasonings all the seasoning that i had prepared at hand so after adding our seasonings, we are going to go ahead and let this saute for about a minute so that way all the seasonings can blend well with everything. So the next ingredient that we're gonna add is one cup of water. And so the water is gonna help us make that soup that we're looking for. So after adding the water, I continue mixing and I let it start boiling. So I let it boil for about five minutes while constantly stirring. And then I added a half teaspoon of salt and I continued mixing everything. So after adding salt, we are going to continue mixing. And after mixing for about a minute, I went ahead and added in a teaspoon of butter. And by the way, guys, this part is optional. You don't have to add a teaspoon of butter. If you want to, you can, but you don't have to. So over here, we continued adding everything. And next, we are going to add in a garnish. And our garnish is cilantro. So and then after that, you know, our food was already done. So guys, I just want to say thank you for those who are watching, for those who are subscribing. And I hope you guys enjoy this video. And I'm definitely going to leave everything in the description below, all the ingredients that I use, because I did not mention my ingredients, but I have all the ingredients and I'll definitely put them in the description below so you guys can have them. So over here, we are just plating our rice and I'm eating my sausage with balsamic rice. This meal was definitely so good with the balsamic rice. So guys, thank you for watching. I'll definitely see you next time when I make something new. Bon appetit. Bye. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button.